I'd like to thank the board and the district personnel for making this possible. It's unfortunate that it's not going to be on video captured with the right commentary for that topic, but I appreciate the time, so thank you. I'd like once again to thank the board, and I stand against the fake recall. The recall of Madison Minor and Rick Ledesma is, is an attempt to overturn a free and fair election. The battle was hard fought and won by a community that voted for change. Parents and other community members learned what was happening to our public schools. We heard stories about litter boxes. We heard and saw teachers that were having classes pledge allegiance to the progressive rainbow flag. And we've heard other teachers with Antifa and community flag, communist flags brag that they had 180 days to turn their students into revolutionaries. And parents have had enough. You use our tax dollars to fund your propaganda and your criminal behavior. When the recall efforts were failing, the Democrat Party, Marxists, unions, communists, and others came to the rescue to fund signature collectors. The recall petitioners were everywhere, earning thousands of dollars because they were paid out-of-state collectors. The recall was not made up of concerned community members. Thank you. The radical recall is being heavily funded and backed by the teachers union. Greg Goodlander, the president of the teachers union, OESD, called parents enemies in the planning and funding meeting by the recall, which was held off site away from the public and denies it today, even though it's on film. The teachers union executive director, Roger, is on film saying that they are funneling money from multiple organizations to fuel the real recall. The money is coming from the California teachers union. Not even the teachers of our district could fund all this money for a radical recall. This is not grassroots, as they claim. This is going to cost the taxpayers an additional $500,000 on top of the millions we spent on the 2022 elections. The recall was initiated based on the accusations that there was a Brown Act violation. Trustee Erickson is the one who violated it per the DA investigation and continues to do so. The recall are blaming trustees Minor and Ledesma when it should be Erickson being recalled for the actual violation. Trustee Anna Page must rec recuse herself from voting since she has the financial gain. Thank you. Gain. Thank you.